Greetings to everyone out there and welcome back to Around the Clock and today we have some exciting news because fans have found some evidence that might lead to F-Zero potentially coming to the Nintendo Switch in 2020. Now earlier this week if you all remember I made a video on the Zippo leak containing new information on the Super Mario 35th anniversary collection coming to the Nintendo Switch and within that video I also made it aware that fans have discovered a brand new Twitter account for Super Mario 35th anniversary. Now. At the moment, I didn't know if this Twitter account was actually real, it was probably fan made in my opinion, but at this point, this just may be real because fans have also found a brand new F-Zero account which looks similar to the 35th anniversary Mario Twitter account. As you can see here, this is what it looks like. Now, neither one of these Twitter accounts are active at the moment, the F-Zero account as well as the Super Mario 35th anniversary, but what's interesting about this F-Zero Twitter account is that this was made back in March of 2020. So. This has a little more credence than the Super Mario 35th anniversary one and if this is indeed true and they have an F-Zero Japanese account that is not used at the moment is not active then I believe that a new F-Zero game will be heading to the Nintendo Switch this year. It is possible that Nintendo is just waiting for a big announcement such as a Nintendo Direct that has been rumored for later on in July but we will have to wait and see what happens. One thing I do know is that a lot, a lot of old school fans such as myself will be happy if another F-Zero game is announced and it is coming to the Nintendo Switch. It has been so long since we got a traditional F-Zero game and I believe it's been 15 to 16 years. Now, there is a F-Zero clone on the Nintendo Switch at the moment which is Fast RMX which is a fantastic game but at the same time, it's not the same. We need a traditional F-Zero bring back the franchise Nintendo and hopefully all this evidence leads up to a brand new game heading to the Nintendo Switch this year. Alright everyone, that's going to do it for this video. What are your thoughts on everything that was discussed here? Please let me know down in the comment section below and if you like this video, make sure to hit that like button because it really does help out the channel and gives exposure to other people who do not know about around the clock. Also, please share this video as well. If you're not already subscribed, be sure to hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell so that you don't miss out on new and daily Nintendo news content right here at Around the Clock where here we focus on Nintendo gaming news around the clock. Catch you guys in the next one.